So I imagine it wouldn't be that hard to actually take King's Landing as as Renly. Or even like the people... I mean, I'm not even sure if Renly is at war with the Lannisters. Or if he's just at war with the people of Dragonstone. Like uh, Stannis' men. But who knows? He might be. Let's go back up north, I guess. Until Rob decides to do something magical. But for now, he is simply biding his time. And just walking around the north. Not really doing much, just taking him the countryside. Moving from camp to camp. Just not doing anything. That's Bran's birthplace right there. How wonderful for Bran. Yes, yeah, so I think as I was saying, um, I'd really love for Rob to call like all the banners. Invalid troops, apparently. Script errors. Yeah, I'd really love for Rob to call like all his men together and we just go south and just take names. But somehow I don't think that's going to happen. Or maybe it is. We're heading south again, so... It looks like we're chasing some bandits, which we'll never catch because we just have way too many men. Okay, cool. Hopefully we just don't go down to... Uh, the moat place down here. Hopefully we go past it and properly go south. Yeah, I think it'd be fun though to play as the uh, wildlings as well and try and like take some. Because I know there's like wildling raiders which are like bandits in the north. But it'd be nice to actually play as the wildlings and actually like take some land for them. Maybe there should be like a proper like script or something which just spawns like 400 wildlings or something every so often and the north have to go deal with it. I think that would be pretty cool. So yeah we are actually going south for once which is nice. Hopefully we can besiege something that would be pretty fun to fight in another siege. Like if we besiege this place or something that would be a nice bit of extra land. Oh they actually took this place as well. I'm pretty, yeah, they, they took this place as well. The Tullys are wrecking. But I'm pretty sure they lost some of this, maybe? Maybe they even owned it. I'm not sure. But yeah, they're, they're actually taking some places. And we're actually coming down to hopefully get in some battles. Hopefully we're not just going to go ahead. Oh, please don't say we just go all the way back up. If we do, if we do just go all the way back up, then I'm probably just going to go ahead and abandon Rob. The torment and death because it, I, I assume this just isn't fun to watch me probably just going back and forth which I'm pretty sure he's doing but then again I could you know further my cause uh, let's go ahead and upgrade into that pikeman we might actually have pretty good equipment now yeah but I we do but I don't have a cloak which is unfortunate but armor wise I have pretty nice armor which I'm happy with so if we return to duty, see what I really want him just to go down, but maybe I, if I can, I can tell him to request a meeting. Appears to speak with you. Continue. We meet again, John Flackenbridge. I'm here to deliver you my demands. Some personal leave. I wish to ask you something. Can I tell him to do something in the war? Uh, how goes war? We are at war over Westerlands. I know. Tell me more about this war. No clear winner has yet emerged in this fight. Thank you. Uh, can I tell him what to do in the war? I'd love to be able to tell him to do what to do in the war. Uh... Nah, but it looks like there isn't. I have a plan for my children, what a dickhead. Return in two weeks. Okay, cool. I didn't want to do that. I just wanted to have a look. Is he going to go off? Can I just come back and I just return straight away? I'm ready to return to your command. Cool. That's all I wanted to do. So apparently by the looks of it, I can just leave him when I want. If I click I want to retire then I'm sure he will let me. Oh this is reading some of the stuff. 
But yeah, unfortunately, apparently we are going north again. So what I'm going to do... I, I guess if, if I don't... I assume if I do want to retire from his services, I have to give back all the equipment he gave me, which is unfortunate. But, oh well. What I'm actually going to do is I'm going to let it play and I will stop recording now just to see what Rob does. And if he doesn't do anything, say, within the next five minutes, I'll probably just leave his services. But I don't think I'll make you guys watch that because all he's going to be doing is walking around Winterfell for a long time. Oh, hold on. What's happened? Uh, Rinley Berefrian has now forged an alliance with the Tyrells and may now, may now join him. So... I I think because it's not obviously the real Westeros and it's just a game. Like, look how much land they cover. Well, I guess they they cover as much land as the Lannisters. But now the Lannisters are fighting from two sides, so they're pretty fucked, I think. But yeah, that was kind of interesting that there's actually events which make stuff like that happen. But yeah, as I was saying, I'm gonna stop recording now and start recording again if Rob actually does anything. And if he doesn't, then we'll go off solo and join one of the Tullys or something who actually get into fights. So Rob got himself into a battle. I think the odds are against him. I mean, he only has 558 men against the enemy. The enemy's forces of 14. So I'm not quite sure if Rob will fight it. I mean, Rob will win this battle, but we'll we'll try our best. I will try my best to honour Rob's honour. Some other uh, interesting things happened as well. Whilst it was uh, not recording, the Lannisters took River, La uh, River Run from the from the Tullys, which was I thought kind of interesting. Oh my god, just look at Rob's men streaming. Hopefully we can get there in time to actually do something. I mean, we get loot either way, but still, it'd be nice to actually... It'd be nice to get some kills and level myself up. So yeah, I think what we're going to do is we're going to diversify the next upgrade we get. We're going to diversify into being a sergeant because I think having a sword a sword will be a lot better than having a pike. Even though pikes seem to be doing so much damage in this mod. And you know, you keep people at a distance and just stab. Seems to be the way forward. There's some pikes there as well. Our cavalry, but it looks like I'm not even going to get there in time. Which I guess... It, Guess what happens when you don't ha have a horse and you have like 500 other horses? Just run around with a two handed axe. So, pretty much, this was just killing some wildlings. Unfortunately, I didn't really get to do anything in there. And yeah. So, I didn't get to kill anyone, which kind of sucks. We get a wildling kite shield around 28 gold. Huzzah! So yeah, I mean Rob has 400 men, I just want him to go ahead and do something with them. Oh yeah, I'll show you guys River Run as well. River Run has been taken, where the hell even am I? Okay, Twins is there, last... Okay, I'm lost. Let's go back. Okay, cool. Now I know where, I don't know where the fuck I was going. Oh uh, yeah, so you can see, the Riverlands has been taken by the Lannisters, which is kind of funny. But the... Did they lose some more land over here? I think they lost this castle, or maybe these cast, maybe these cities are to the river run. But yeah, they keep, they still hold Harrenhal as well, which is good. The Tyrells are just sort of chilling, so yeah, the Tyrells haven't taken any land off the Lannisters. Neither have the Stormlands, or or neither have uh, neither has Stannis. So let's go back to see what Rob is doing, just chilling around Winterfell. Quite a few people are meeting up though. The Westerlands have just taken quite a few uh, of the Reach's Lord's prisoner as well. Yeah, they just lost a load of battles. The Westerlands are wrecking apparently. At least looking at it. They're looking at like the little notes which pop up. I'm not sure how clear it is to you guys because it's really small writing. I have to like squint at the screen and have a look. But by the looks of it, loads of the, the Reach's men just got destroyed. And then again, like loads of the Westerlands lords just get taken prisoner. It's a very back and forth war. 
and Rob just seems to be, oh, here we go. I'm glad I waited with Rob. The boys are out. The boys are heading north, apparently. At least I hope the boys are heading north. Because all the North men just went north. I mean, all, all the North men just went south. And if Rob just goes back to, up to Winterfell, I'd be so pissed. I'm pretty sure he's not like so many men. We have so many men. But there's like a good thousand men between us all. And hopefully because it's the AI controlling it, Rob will just go with them all. And you're kidding me. If he goes, I'm leaving if he goes past past Greywater Watch. Literally about a thousand men just went there. And you're going back up north, Rob. Yep, screw you. Let's have a meeting and I'm leaving. Uh, how do I look? Request a meeting, continue. Oh, Rob, it hurts me to do this, but you're just... I wish to retire from your service. I am relieved of my duty. So, I can't believe he's going up north, for real. Literally, like, everyone is going south to fight in a battle. Do I get to keep all my equipment? Probably looks like I don't get to keep all of it. No, I don't get to keep any of it. How sad. I am an emotional guy. Uh, but, yeah. So, what we'll do is we'll go ahead and join a tully or something. And I think that would be a cool idea. I lost my horse as well as a bandit soon. I fuck. I'm so slow about a horse. How much money do I have? Not enough to buy a horse. So let's try and find where all these north are. Oh, there you go. The north men will be over here. Besieging this place. And we'll just... No, you bastard. I'll pay for my passage. Have 89 coins and piss off. No, oh my god. Why? Go on, you guys. It's because I'm so fucking slow. And I'm going to miss that siege now as well. Because these dickheads are taking me all the way over here. Like, grats. That was a real good thing. Yeah, it's a battle. John Umber. I'm going to join the Umbers. The Umbers are so cool. Piss off. Piss off. Piss off. Just let me pass and get into this battle. Oh, you took it, you dicks. Well, hopefully I can still find John Umber and join him. Because the Umbers are so cool. Oh my god, look, why did Rob leave? Like, look how many dudes are here. I just need to find him. Mr. Umber. Is there another Umber? John Umber, there you go, great John Umber. Right here, look at him, he looks like a beast. Uh, my lord, I'd like to list, enlist in your army. Oh, that's cool, and you keep your position in the army as well. So yeah, I'll definitely join him. Hopefully he just, just doesn't go back north, which I'm, I'm kind of scared he's going to just go back north. If he goes back north, what I will do is I will go ahead and end the episode here. Because it's been a good 20 minutes, 30 minutes, long episode. Unfortunately, we haven't really done much in the episode. But that's not my fault, that's Rob's fault. Uh, what I will do is I will just stay in his service until they go back south. And then I'll stop recording again or something in a new episode. So yeah, if you enjoyed this episode, please do go ahead and like and subscribe. Um, next episode what we will be doing is we'll be going south with John Umber. If you guys want me to continue doing this, if you guys don't want me to do this and think that I should just go off by myself and recruit loads of North men and just do my own thing with all my own North men and not follow these guys into battle, then I will go ahead and do that. But if you guys do want me to continue being a, a North, just a North man, a North mercenary, I guess, it's called, or a bannerman, I should say, then I'll be more than happy to do that. Because I think this is kind of fun, just going around the Lord, but there's not really much action. So I imagine it could be a little bit boring to watch. I mean, again, we are going, by the looks of it, we are going north. Uh, exhausted traveller comes up. The realm is in chaos. Lord Stannis has declared himself king. Of so all the people are going to war now. So now Stannis is at war. Is he at war with everyone, or what? Hopefully Rob uh, makes an alliance with Renly, that'd be cool. That's always, I'll talk about that more in the next episode, but Renly and Rob, that's always the kind of, the alliance I always wanted to happen. But yeah, so yeah, if you enjoyed this, please do like and subscribe, that'd be awesome, and I will see you guys next time, and fish out.